as Dokkan is based on WooCommerce, so it supports WooCommerce taxes. The vendors can choose those tax classes when establishing or modifying products, and you, as the admin, can configure taxes from the backend. Let's see how the whole process works. First, go to the WooCommerce settings section. Then, you have to check the box for Enable Taxes under General Options. This will open up a new tab in the Settings page called Tax. In this page, click on Standard Rates. You can add new rates by clicking on the Insert Row button. Provide the Country Code, State Code, Host Code, City, Rate, Tax Name, Priority, Compound, and Shipping. If you want, you can import or export from CSV files. In the similar way, you can add reduced rate rates and add zero rate rates. Let's see how the vendors can use it. When you are done setting up taxes, you'll have the Dokkan tax class listed with the other ones you have. Now, move to the product page and go to any product edit screen. Scroll down and go to shipping and tax. Here vendor can select only the tax classes from the drop down and hit save. The taxes will be applied to the checkout page automatically. This is it. This way admin can add tax and the vendor can use it for its customers. If you want to learn more tips and tricks about Dokkan, subscribe to our newsletter, read our blogs and follow us on our social pages. The link is in the description. Lastly, don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel.